And ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to day two of the Little Athletics Victoria State Track and Field Championships. We are here at Knox. It is slightly sunny outside. The air temperature is a little bit warm, but we are very gifted with the back straight gum tree sun, a shade that is. So looking for a start here. We'll introduce the field to you now. Event 201. This is down to 12 boys, 1500 metre. Clean start away from Station 1, Felix from Campbell or Malvern, 3, Freddie from Campbell or Malvern, 4, Hayden from Chelsea, 5, Michael from Collingwood, 6, Manaya from Warrnambool, 7, Cody from Keelor, 9, Liam from Berwick, 10, Flynn from Knox, 11, Jake from Box Hill, 13, Banjo from Southern Peninsula, 14, Gus from Collingwood, 15, Archer from Ballarat, 16, Thomas from South Melbourne District, 17, Ashton from Chelsea, 18, Samuel from Yarra Rangers, 22, Joshua from, uh, from Mornington, and 23, Archie from Geelong. So a little bit of a pack forming at the moment. That's being led by Freddie from Campbell and Malvern. We'll just position ourselves just to view where we're sitting. That's Manaya sitting in second, Cody third. Uh, so Cody fourth, actually, and that would be Jake from Box Hill currently sitting in third. In amongst that group as well is Archie from Geelong as well. So as they make their way past the finish line, they will complete three more laps before they complete their race. So the taller figure out in front at the moment, uh, Freddie from Campbell Malvern, he won the 800 yesterday and he is in mighty fine form right at the moment. Uh, Manaya too in the shades. He ran well in the 800 as well. Um, and he was actually second last year overall. So our state champion from last year isn't here today. Um, so this really opens up those medal positions. Some, some really great camera viewing there from the back straight. So athletes come past. It still is at this moment. Freddie looks like they're now in second place. We've had Jake jump into second. So Jake's jumped into second. Manai's dropped back just slightly. And then we've got a smaller figure moving on the outside there at the moment. I think that might be even Hayden from Chelsea. So we'll just see how we go as we come into shot. I'll just see if I can actually see who that is sitting in that fourth place position. Pack starting to bunch up a little bit at the moment. And it actually is Hayden from Chelsea. So Hayden from Chelsea running really strongly at the moment. Cody Levitas has actually jumped onto the back of that group as well. Now, Cody had a great race last weekend at the state championships at... Uh, Athletics Victoria, or it might have been weekend one. He ran a 4.44 um, along with the absent Jace, uh, Jensen from Altona. So Manai ran a 4.45 as well. So he's in the uh, the warnable colours of the light blue top in that lead group at the moment. So lead group still being led by Fred from Freddie from Campbell Mulvin. Jake's running strongly still in second. Manaya in third. Cody's moved up into that fourth position and starting to open his stride up a little bit and safely position himself moving in to the bend here at the 200 meter mark. Not too far off the back of that pack is Hayden from Chelsea still. So Hayden running a really great race. He came in with a seated time of 4.56. So a little bit off the pace of some of the other boys, but not too far between them. Freddie's, uh, Freddie's time is actually at 4.46 and Hayden's was a 4.56. So he's 10 seconds off. So if he can tag onto this group, they're gonna ride him around for a great time leading into the final lap. So the boys are going to move up into the bell lap this time round. As they come into shot now, Freddie's racing well. Jake's coming up to his shoulder and Cody's tagged on into that group. Manai's dropped off the back of slightly now. And I think it's going to be down to these three and they're really going to put in a sprint finish. Don't deny Manai is still at this moment. He did place very well yesterday and also was second overall in this event last year. So he might see who pops out of the back of this lead group as they come past the bell. But it still is... Freddie, Jake and Cody in that group of three at the front. So as they move around the back straight, does look like Jake's on the attack at the moment. Cody's really grabbing on just to make that band not stretch. Focus is down, but Freddie's probably going to have to have a little bit of a kick, and I think he's going to open up that kick now. You can look at the grit and the determination on his face right now. Jake's not going to give up on this one either. So they do start to drop Cody off the back a little bit here now, but Jake's starting to make a spike for a charge. He's going to wait till it's safe, and I think you'll find at the 100-meter mark he might have an attack at this now. So it's still Freddie, Jake, and Cody, the top three here. I believe the medals aren't going to change out of these three. So as this sprint finish comes down, we're going to open it up. Freddie's really stridden ahead. He's got that long length in his legs, and he's actually going to cross the line, taking out first. J 
Jake will come through as second, Cody in third. And Manaya, great race for him. He'll take four. We've got Hayden from Chelsea next. Liam from Berwick. Flynn from Knox with a late charge by Felix from Campbell Morven. Great lean for the line there. Then we've got our Mornington Collingwood athletes. Second Chelsea athlete, Geelong. Berwick. Samuel from Yarra Rangers. And our final competitors making their way all across the line. Great race there. Our first track event of the day. Our under 12 boys, 1500 metre final.